going to show you how to turn off or restart a Samsung Galaxy S21. There's several ways to do this, okay? So the first way is this. If you want to bring up the power off menu, you have to press and hold the volume down and power button. You have to press and hold. If you just press both buttons really quickly, that's going to take a screenshot. Now, if you hold it, volume down, power, one, two, three. If you press and hold, now it's going to bring off the power off menu here, and you can power off or you can restart. Now, some people would like just, just to uh, make it easy so they remember. If you press and hold the power button, by default, it's going to bring up Bixby, okay? However, we can make the power button press and hold to bring up the power off menu as well. If you want to do that, just press and hold again, volume down, power button, bring up the power off menu first. And then it says side key settings, which is basically the power button here. So let's tap on side key here. And you can see by default, if we press and hold, it's going to wake up Bixby, okay? But however, you have one down here, power off menu. So let me tap on that. Now, if you press and hold the power button, now you get the power off menu. Now, another way to restart it, let's say that um, your screen was frozen and the buttons aren't working where you're, where you're able to bring up the um, power off menu. Another thing you can do is you can force it to restart, okay? So basically, if your phone is frozen or whatnot, and it's the same thing again, volume down, power button, except this time you want to press and hold and do not let go until, this, until you see the Samsung logo appear. So let's do it together. Volume down, power button. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold. Do not let go. I'm still holding on both buttons. Still holding. Just continue to hold until the, um, basically the phone reboots and you see the Samsung logo. Then you can go ahead and let go. So still holding here. Volume down, power button. Actually, it's good right here. I can still go ahead and let go. I don't have to wait for the Samsung logo to pop up but just give it a second here and it's going to go ahead and boot back up there we go and it's i just forced it to restart so pretty simple any questions or issues just uh comment below all right